Remove all these patches. I think I hear a Zed out there. Endurance regain disabled. Yeah, it's about time for bed. I kind of want to see if we can get to uh, level 4 tailoring, though. That's that's kind of a big deal. Yeah. The sooner we get to level 8 tailoring, the sooner we'll be able to repair our clothes to the fullest extent we can, you know? How many ripped sheets do we have left? 83. Okay, we started off with 118. So that's not terrible. Remove all these patches. There it is. I was literally just about to check. Alright, yeah, let's go to bed. Let's go to bed. Check the groin bandage one last time. Yep. Alright, and let's get some shut eye. And uh, tomorrow, or rather today, I plan on going into town real quick just to grab a stove. Actually, no, I want to go into town and grab a stove because I'm looking for cabinets as well, remember. So, cabinet, stove, a couple of things, and a couple of things. Oh, yeah, let's uh, let's go ahead and dry our clothes, clothes as well. Uh, turn on dryer mode. Uh, turn on. There we go. This is so cool. I I really do like that. That's such a nice that's such a nice little thing. Really does help make this house even more of a home. All right, get kitted up. Hey, what's up, David? How you doing, man? You said something's different. Yeah, you already know. Shout out, my boy. Hold up, let me. Ah, oh, shit. I don't have my shout out command set up, but uh, if you like my content, you're gonna love David's content. He plays a. Uh, a lot of Escape from Tarkov, which is a game I'd love to try out, but I, I can't. Unfortunately, I am too much of a weenie. I don't need that kind of stress in my life, chat. <laughs> but he's he's great, man. He's great. But yeah, uh, thanks to him, let me get back to that point. Thanks to him, I was able to move my uh, move my setup around a little bit. So what had happened was I was looking to rearrange my room a little bit just to kind of have it flow better. And I realized, oh, I can move my desk from here to there. And I did, with his help. You said Tarkov is way too hard. That's what I've seen. Bro, I picked up one gun in a server with bots, and I just left. I was like, I can't deal with this stress. All right, the dirty groin bandage is not looking epic. Still bitten. Bandage that, bandage that little cock up, bro. You got this. Be lying, you said it gets easier to get it, or if it gets easier. Gee, jeez. Hey, man. That's why, that's why I stick to Zomboid, bro. Cause I, this suffering, I, I know this suffering. Go ahead and. Get to watering. Not enough water in inventory, huh? Fill. Fill all. There we go. We do have some pest problems. Did start Valley with zombies. This is literally the greatest game of all time, man. That's why I'm. I love this so much. And I got it on the roof, and I got a wall. It's good stuff, man. It's real good stuff. Not enough water inventory. Oh, shit. Wow. I'll go ahead and fill everything. Where did all those... Oh, there it is. Yeah, they're in the uh, the wrong inventory. Oh, well. Anxiety, depression, and smoking. We actually beat anxiety. We're no longer a smoker. Uh, the depressed one died. Yeah, we had, a, we had a depressed character, and he just kind of got eaten by zombies and shit. Which is, you know, it's bound to happen to everybody in this game, but, you know. He said, holy W. Hey, man, I mean, shit happens, man. He was he was not built for this world, but this guy is. He's just like me for real. All right. 
Let's go ahead and get this one a little bit more water. What a Giga Chad low key. High key, dude. This guy is absolutely based. I haven't had iced coffee in so long, chat. Usually I have hot coffee. This shit is beautiful, man. There we go. Hasn't rained at all in April, dude. I thought April showers were supposed to bring May flowers. And what is this shit? Not epic is what this is, chat. It is not epic. We're actually going to use some of these cabbages. I'm not sure how many cabbages I planted. I'm pretty sure... Not enough water in inventory. Damn. I'll go ahead and fill the wok pan. And fill the kettle. But yeah, man. No, no... No water from the sky. Not a fan, I gotta be honest. I need that shit. Expeditiously. Well watered. Yeah, these guys are well watered. Make sure... Well, we'll make sure they stay that way. Planted enough water. And I'm pretty sure one of you has a problem, right? Tree problem. Pest flies, yeah. Pest flies, pest flies. Insecticide spray. Good stuff. Do I not? Insecticide spray. I thought I grabbed it. Did I not? Maybe I moved. Nope. There it is. Maybe I just don't have enough. Yeah, that's probably it. I think that's it. Okay. Um, tell you what. It feels like a bit of a shame, but to be honest, it's fairly easy to make more of this. So let's go ahead and just pour this out. Any pests that were in this general area. Just gone. Reduced to ashes. Uh, make fly cure. It's really just water and cigarette butts. It's Flies are fairly simple to take care of. Pest flies unknown. No disease on any of these guys. Pest flies. Hmm. <coughs> There you go. All right. We got some, what is this? Zucchini, tomatoes, lettuce, and cabbage. What else do I want to grow? Let's see. Uh, before we do that, groin is bandaged up. Good shit. You'll love to see it. Uh, let's go ahead and add water from the wok pan. There we go. Mary 420 IRL time. Yes, sir. Well, I'm about two hours ahead of you, so it's 620 for me, but... I appreciate the, uh, appreciate it, man. But, Mary 420. Mary 420. All right, what are we, anything that needs to go up here, honestly? Not particularly. A lot of this stuff just needs to... Why do you... Hmm. That's another time that's happened. Not sure why my machete and my knife just automatically hopped off my hotkeys, but that's happened a couple of times before, and I'm starting to starting to wonder what's going on. Let's go ahead and put some seasonings in here, because there's no other place to put them. Fish sauce. Just did good if you gotta bandage the groin. I'm gonna be honest, Wolf, that is that is not the move. If she needs you if you need to bandage your groin after whatever marriage or outside of marriage activities you're taking part in bro see a doctor get some help that shit is not normal but hello wolf how you doing man welcome on into stream good to see you glad to have you hope you're having a fantastic day i hope you continue to have a fantastic day man welcome, welcome, welcome. that shit is gnarly bro like scary gnarly i'd be out of there like ee! like whoosh all right. Uh, do I need a trowel to? Well, no. 
But we're going in to get a stove, so let's do that now. And then, uh, either today or tomorrow, we'll take care of the, uh, the turning radius here. Current speed is 45 miles an hour. You pissing your pamper for real? Damn. Pissy pamper. Now that's a name I haven't heard in a long time. This, this dude, Cardi, really has a release. Pissy pamper featuring young nudie. That's kind of crazy, I'm going to be honest. Do you think it's because people leaked it already and he just doesn't want to, you know, he wants to punish the leakers by not giving us the official version? Or do you think maybe he lost or he just doesn't have it? I am literally falling asleep right now, chat. I've, I got to wake myself up. Oh, my God. Still not used to it. Buzz, it's finally ringing. Thank God, I didn't even notice. Oh, as soon as I... Fuck, fuck this game, dude. As soon as I notice, it's like... Mm, yeah, no more rain for you. Sorry, bud. Come on, man. Get your motor running. Let's head to Gen A's table. That's Spiffos. How's the groin looking? Good. Ooh, more rain. You love to see it. I don't know what kind of coat that is, but I want it. There you go. Wah. Wah. Wah, wah. Wah, wah. What kind of coat is that? Let's see. Hmm. Take the cigarettes. I'm sorry for ruining your, your party, Lieutenant Diane. She tasted like cigarettes. Thank God, man. Rain. We love the rain. We love the rain. I love the rain in real life, too, Chad. Rain is such a pleasant pleasant just you know looking outside and it's raining and it's, you know it's not like a i don't mind thunderstorms but there's something about just like a nice calm peaceful rain it's just really refreshing all right this is where we got bit last time chat so let's not make any stupid moves oh no no, I think I'll I think I'll pass actually. No, that's uh that is for someone braver than I. Not me, bitch. Not me. Gosh golly, man. Yeah, this that was a job for my shotgun. I seem to left my shotgun in my other pants, chat, so we're gonna have to deal with them later. Only thing you hate about rain is actually getting wet. That's fair. A lot of people don't really like that. A lot of it causes... I'm not sure if sensory overload is the right way to say it, but for a lot of people, that is the case. It's just like, oh, too much is going on. I don't like feeling this. I don't like feeling that. It's just too much. Hey, man, that is completely fair. I don't mind the rain, actually. I, 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 I appreciate just standing out in the rain, just looking up and being like, damn, bro, this is really my life. I am doing really well at the moment, you know? You gotta be appreciative, chat. Take a minute and, uh, you know, appreciate what you, what you have in life. And if you're not 100% happy with how your life is going, you know, you gotta take some time and figure out what you wanna do to make yourself happy, I guess, right? That's what I'm trying to do. I'm fairly content at the moment, but I'd like to, uh, I'd like to sort out what else I want from life, you know? I wanna figure out what my purpose is. Or rather, I want to find my purpose because I don't. I don't know if there's like this whole. I don't. Under, I don't think there's like any one purpose that someone has. You know, I think life is what you make of it, right? You don't like getting wet unless you're swimming or taking a shower. Hey, man, totally valid. Totally valid. I'm gonna start. Excuse me. I'm gonna start using the short blade. Hold up. I'm starting to feel my strength coming back to me, chat. Hold up. 
Like, I was tired as hell, but I think that coffee's finally starting to kick in. Shout out my boy, Yo Infamous, for the coffee, dude. David coming in clutch as per usual. Oh, this military knife is going kind of... Yeah, it's already a little busted. Can't say I like that. I do not like that. Shout out, Yo Infamous. He plays Valorant, too. He says, shout out, Yo Infamous. I mean, true. Yeah, dude, this apocalypse is gnarly. Every door has been broken. Everyone's sad. I'm gonna be honest, bro. Zombie apocalypse hits. There's only two things. I'm not gonna just get by. I'm either going to be the best survivor in the entire wasteland, or I'm going to die in the first five minutes. There's really no in-between for me, chat. It's not a matter of pride. It's just a matter of fact. I can, I'm only going to be the best survivor in the world, or I'm going to be the worst survivor in the world i'll be i'll be either rick what's the name rick grimes or uh uh ground zero you know what i mean yami uh disassemble the telly you miss dexter i don't know bro like i think he's i think he's kind of struggling with like like drug issues at the moment like you know sort that shit out hopefully hopefully he bounces back I'm still thinking about that one freestyle he did. I don't think that shit was called for. I th I know it wasn't called for. But you know, I do miss Japan Dexter. Let me let me change that up then. I do miss Japan Dexter. Mm. 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 Just beautiful, man. Beautiful. The zombies run were fucked. Uh, we that shit will be fun to me. I'll be like, all right, let's do this shit. I am ready and raring to go. I hear you, bitch. I hear you breathing. Your smile or your kiss? Is that just some horn dog type shit that I just picked up? Like an audiobook porno? That's a real thing, chat. That's crazy. That's, there's a niche for that. I'm not speaking from experience. I'm just saying there's got to be a niche for that somewhere, right? Ooh, another coach gun. I'll take that. Sure, yeah. Never hurts to have two. Dismantle the earbuds. What do we have here? Ammo maker manual. Hell out. Dismantle this. Yeah, I knew you were in here. I just didn't know where. Psst. Come on. There he is. Psst. That's such a cool feature. I didn't realize this until recently. I'd seen other people do, but I never knew how to do it myself. So if you crouch and press the button to shout, which is, uh, I think, Q, usually. Get up. Get up. Get up. Did I? Oh, yeah. I fell into the glass. Okay. Uh, dirty groin bandage, scratched and bleeding. Go ahead and use adhesive bandages on this. Remove bandage there. Took her to my place. Baby gave me like some cake. Wait. Think it is late. I'm getting past eight. It's not a date. Hold up. Oh man, it's it's been too long since I've because that song is like legitimately. I'm gonna be honest, bro. That song kind of carried 2020 or 2018. Like, I can go through my memories, like my, what do you call my Spotify memories, and be like, all right, this song carried this year. Japan literally put 2018 in its backpack, man. That shit was nuts. The instrumental alone is one of the most powerful things. When I first heard it, it sounded like the second coming of Jesus Christ, but like located specifically in my ears, chat. It was beautiful. I could feel like tears begin to swell in my eyes and I was like, this is it. This is the best piece of music I'm ever gonna hear. I think we can count ourselves lucky at least. We didn't get any glass shards stuck in our arm. That would have been gnarly. Uh, nails, nice. We're actually running, a, we were running a little bit low on nails, so it's good to find these. But like I said, no glass shards in the arm, so count your blessings, man. All right, let's hit 
this over here. Generator, a Gen A. Um, wire, oh, wire chain. Like the chain user from Hunter Hunter? <gasps> Nail gun, eh. Nah. Literally looked outside when you heard the first time, like, no fucking way. That's what I'm saying, dude. It's so beautiful. Like, I just remember, like, clutching my face. Just like, this is the most beautiful music I'll ever listen to. And I felt a deep sorrow knowing that nothing would ever surpass it. Ooh, sports fishing book. Yellow. Yeah, Entering my itchy nose arc chat. Y'all already see it. Mm. 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 Ooh, Amazon. Amazon dropped off a sledgehammer? Thank you. Oh, we're, no, 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 no. We're going home. We're going home. We're going home. There is no way. No, we're going home. A black trench coat. Nah, I'm cool. I'm, uh, I, I don't, nah. That's not the look I'm going for. That's like a Punisher type beat. Nah. I'm gonna leave that to, you know, the professional Punisher. Punisher is cool, man. Like, watching that shit on, watching that shit on Netflix? Yeah. It's a great show. Oh, there's a cop. Hey, buddy. Need to get some food in me. Do I have any? Do I have any food in my inventory? Hold up, one second, buddy. I have insecticide spray, but no food. What kind of janky packing was I doing? Oh, is that a? Is that a Remington? What you got for me? Nice fuzzy coat. I'll take it. I like fuzzy things. Mossberg 500 and a Beretta. Hmm. I'll take the Beretta. Yeah, sure. And I'll take the Mossberg too. Well, uh, worst case scenario. Actually, yeah, I think I'll just. Uh, unload it and break it down. And uh, sorry if stream is lagging, because I know it is, chat. Uh, my internet's been acting up for the past couple of days. Uh, there's nothing I can do about it. We've tried, and uh, it, it's just not it's just not great at the moment. So hopefully it bounces back in the next couple of days. I, I truly I truly hope so. Truly do. Ooh, more rain. Chocolate rain, some, some stay dry and others feel the pain. I didn't know that song was about racism until like someone mentioned it. They were like, yo, this song is actually about racism. Chocolate rain is an allegory for how some people will, you know, experience racism and other people will deny it because they don't see it or experience it. And I was like, oh shit. This nigga kinda, this nigga kinda cool. Big brain, bro. Just got a random ass sausage in here, bro. This stinky ass sausage just chilling in the back of my car. Huh? What's this? What's this music? Oh, it's two dudes. Let me, bro, before I go, let me see if I can find a, a nice looking stove. Because I don't really want to use one of the green ones. I'm going to be picky. I know. I know. I don't need to be picky, but I'm being picky right now. We could actually... Let's actually grab the, uh, see if we can grab this. Yeah, the human hamster wheel. Also want to grab that at some point. Uh, we'll probably come back for it. We'll circle back. We'll circle back. Yeah, because the car is parked literally right here. It's not a problem. Golly, dude, yesterday was crazy. Look at all this carnage. I like I'm like Carnage Kabuto from One Punch Man. How are the leggy weggies doing? There we go. Hmm. All right, human hamster wheel goes in the trunk. 
yeah, we're going to need to fix up the trunk at some point, man, because right now we were at 100. Now it's at 87 capacity. Kind of gnarly. Not a fan of that. Do you have any seeds on you? You look like a farmer. And yes, it is because of the overalls. And unfortunately, he did not. That's a shame. That's a shame and a waste. Before we grab the uh, water dispenser, because we don't necessarily need that. Come on. Come on. There we go. Nah, bro. I don't need to risk it. Do not need to risk it, man. I hear those zombies. I can come back another day. That's the thing. I'm not pressed. Let me actually see if I can... Hit this uh, water fountain real quick, just because I need to clean this bandage. Yeah, no need to risk my life for something like a stove right now. I can risk my life for a stove later. There's plenty of time in the day. And then tomorrow, I think we'll take the bandage off our uh, off our our willy. We'll see how that's coming along. <sighs> Yeah, man, I gotta say, you gotta be careful. Gotta be real careful when you're in the zombie apocalypse. You never know who's gonna reach up and bite your willy off. It's not something everybody expects. Which is, you know, understandable. People are worried about turning. People are worried about survival. Not a lot of people are worried about their willies. They're too busy with the other two. We really should just slow down. There we go. Like 30 miles an hour seems good. So many stores I need to hit, man. We need to make a base somewhere in Rosewood. Usually I would go for the firehouse, but the firehouse is beyond compromise. That place is a cesspit. Cesspit, cesspool, regardless, it's a cess something, and it's not great. No, you're not a plague zombie, or a cure zombie. I was hoping, but uh, no, it's not the case. speeding bro i need to go 30 miles an hour <laughs> i i i did run him over on purpose chat i ran him over on purpose because i saw him and i was like eh he'll be all right he'll be all right are we still a pacifist we are and we're about to we're losing weight again we're at 76 i need to gain like four pounds or four kilograms in a couple of days man this shit right here is not good i don't even oh i guess that was a fake dead zombie that's, a, that's something they just recently added, I think. Fake dead zombies. So essentially, chat, what happens is the zombie will be laying there. They're like, oh, he's dead. Nuh-uh, he's a fake dead zombie. So as soon as you're not looking, he gets up and tries to bite you in the neck. <sighs> that was a big yawn, man. I'm tired. Holy shit, I've been streaming for two hours? Golly, that does not feel like two hours. Huh. Time flies when you're having fun. We have fun here, chat. We have fun here. Hmm. Now that we have this sledgehammer, dude. <laughs> ah, shit. Yeah, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to we're gonna have to repair this at some point. Turn, damn you. Fuck. Reverse. Just fucking up the car for no reason at all. That's my way. It is my way. It is my way. Turn right. Uh-huh. Just like that. There you go. There it is, chat. Big brain time. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's gamer time. There we go. Mm. Oh, yeah. This car doesn't look bad at all. It looks fine. Oh, thank God the rain is here. That'll clean the blood off real quick. 
Let's grab some of this shit out of the trunky wonky. Grab, there you go. Seems like we're going to be able to grab all of this, actually. Or, no, nah, most of it. Most of it in the, uh, the big bag. Then this will go here. And then tomorrow's when we make the, uh, tomorrow's going to be when we make the either parking lot or just in the, I think we'll start off with just an area to, uh, you know, swing around, pull in a little easier. But, uh, we also need to start breaking down some of these fences. Yeah, because we don't necessarily need all of them, right? Where's this treadmill gonna go? We could put it out in the hallway, or we could just put it right... We could put it right here, actually. Have it right by the window. That seems nice, actually. That's kind of cool. Oh, yeah, we're gonna... This is what we'll do. Drop this here. Uh, pick this up. Put it right here for now. For now. And then, oh, I guess it can't go there because of the, uh, because of the cork board, I guess you'd call it. I'm not sure what you'd call it, but a uh, cork no notebook, notepad. Yeah. There it is. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Let's go and just grab this. Toss it in here. And, uh, yeah, you can just, just go here. I don't care. That can go there. And then we'll, we'll find somewhere for this. We'll find somewhere for this. Can't we... I was going to say use it. We'll do that tomorrow. Do that tomorrow. We have a couple of things I want to get done before we go to bed. Like, for example, insert six... Is it empty? Oh, it's empty. Let's see if we can just dismantle it then. Craft helper. Disassemble. We need a metal workbench. Got it. Okay. Need to remember how to build a metal workbench, though, because that's not something I, uh, something that's fresh in my memory, chat. It's something I have forgotten, actually. Ooh, avocado. Thought that was going to be rotten by the time we got back. Glad it's not. Hmm. Lots of rotten stuff. Yeah, we'll keep the ground beef. Rotten lime. Corn, sausage, coach gun. I'll tell you what, I think we just go to bed, honestly. I realize that, you know, realize that we still have stuff to put away, but it's it's late. It's 10 p.m. We're kind of, it's not that we're doing badly right now. It's just that we'd rather be in bed, I think. He's had a long couple of days, man. It's been kind of rough for him. I, I feel bad, so. Let me go ahead and just let him get to sleep. We're going to toss this avocado in the fridge, and then we'll just be, uh, we'll let him go. We'll let him go. Peas, yep. Where's the avocado? Is it... Here it is. Good stuff. I was wondering where it was. Let's go. i tell you what, we're probably just going to end up boiling most of these eggs, and hopefully that saves them for a little while longer, because... I don't know, man. That's a, lot. That's a lot of eggs. That's a lot of eggs. Maybe too many eggs, Chad. I love eggs. As much as the next person, but you know. Man cannot survive on eggs alone. That's a lot of protein. Hmm. 6 p.m. on the dock. Really need to grab the uh, grab the bleach and start cleaning up. Wash all your clothes. Mm 
Very hungry boy. Wash yourself off. Six or seven thirty already. Golly, seven forty. Yeah, let's move. Feel like we're wasting a lot of time here. Couple things that I forgot to put up here that I should have. Could also, yeah, those look like they're yeah, young zucchini. Okay, cool. Young tomato, young lettuce, young cabbage. Good stuff. I do want to plant a bit more though, and we'll take care of that in a minute. Right now. Priority is getting all the rotten food in here. Rotten mutton. Rotten milk goes over here. Processed cheese. Lots of, yeah, lots of guns. Lots of guns and lots of gun parts. Shit. No, 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 no. Very eager to keep running, but I need him to run in the right direction. Run, buzzer, buzzer, run. I'm in the shit they like. Go forest, run forest, run forest, go forest. Let me take it 70, okay, 700. <laughs> uh, this coach gun can actually go in the case on top of the, uh, the gun case. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, Mossberg. Yeah, I can go up there with the Mossberg as well. And the Beretta, because why not? Oh, the Beretta doesn't fit. That's too bad. Maybe it'll fit in here? No, no. Okay. Sorry, chat. I'm re responding to some uh, some eight ball pool. Y'all already y'all already know the grind set. The grind set, it never stops. Well, actually, let me pause the game just so I don't, you know, end up wasting too much game time. There we go. Good stuff. Good stuff. Beretta. Well, it's just. Uh, can we? Yeah, rack it, and then eject it. Or rather, you should eject it and then rack it, yeah? Oh, well. <sighs> coffee goes in here. Still need to try out this coffee machine. Any more drinks? Yeah. Package corn. Let's actually get this stuff out of the freezer because I'm going to forget about it because I literally just forgot about it. I was like, all right, do we have anything over here? Probably not. Then I'm like, oh, wait, we do. Crazy. Sort by perishable. Food perishable. Goes in the freezer over here. All right. Eat this bag of chips. Yeah, because we're we're just gonna be eating junk food today. Lots and lots of junk food. His his. All of these. Quagga cakes. Jessica. Still losing weight. This ice cream should balance us out, though. Ice cream. Yep, there you go. Good stuff. All right, cool. Now, time to put some stuff away. Again, take off the helmet. Take off the, the, uh, the, the mask. Unequip. Unequip. Good stuff, good stuff.
And we got a chain and stuff that goes over here. Box of screws, nails, wire. Needles and sledge. Let's go ahead and uh, take a second and use this sledgehammer because I've been waiting a very long while for this. Very long while. I want to use this. Uh... Can I stretch your bed? No. Hmm. Disassemble fancy toilet. Disable. Thought I could break those down. I guess not. Maybe I'm just not clicking the right areas. At least we can break this down, though, right? Oh, no. You gotta be kidding me. There's no way. No. We're stuck with this forever. Oh, destroy. Destroy. Okay, I was looking for the wrong... I was looking at the wrong thing. Looking at the wrong thing. Okay. So let's go ahead and destroy what we have in the bathroom, then. And I think we'll actually connect the two to make, like, a... Some awesome, super, mega, epic base. There we go. Let's go and break that down, because I, I really don't need that toilet for anything. There we go, see? Wait a minute, is that going to... I have a feeling, is that going to break down the... Yep. Shit, all right. Uh, carpentry. I mean, to be fair, like, this could be the shed, honestly. I mean, we're, bu we're building that out there. We could just use this. Because I have no clue what's going to go on in here. So, yeah, shed would be great, actually. So, we'll just put the put a little door right there, and we're good. Uh, disassemble all of this. Disassemble. Dude, the, the plot to Incredibles 2 was not good. I enjoyed it, but I like there were some glaring issues that I took issue with. Like, for example, like the whole the whole idea that what's it called? The girl, the woman is evil because you know. Oh man, the uh, superheroes didn't save my parents. Like, I mean, I get that, but at the same time, your dad's an idiot. Like, so the whole idea is that her dad trusted superheroes so much that he uh. He actually had a little super phone, right? The super phone was supposed to call his super friends. So he called his super friends, but the problem is he had the phone out in the living room, not in the safe room that he had. So his house was getting broken into, and he called his super friends. But what happened is that he got spilt instead, and the lady was like, I hate superheroes. And I'm like, I mean, I get it, but like, Maybe your dad should have put that shit in the, the panic room? I don't know. I feel like that's just a just a smarter thing to do. What am I in here for? Wood and nails. Got it. Yep. Nails. Plank. I think we need a doorknob too. And hinges. I think we only need two. Though I feel like I'm going to uh, understand that we need way more than two in just a second. Go on there. There we go. Cool. Alright. Uh, carpentry. Wall. Wooden wall frame. Let's go and patch this up real quick. Actually, no. This is supposed to be a door. What am I doing? Um, door. Door frame. There you go. Carpentry, door, wooden door. Two more planks. Okay. Two more planks. Two more planks. And obviously, you know, 
we have a wall, so this isn't like. I feel like this should still be priority, right? Like you don't want to, you don't want to have a hole in your base. That would be you know, not smart. I feel. And you know, we'll have two doors. I don't, I don't really care about that. That's fine. Is there anything else I wanted to do in here? I think a store. I think having storage in here is kind of. Oh, just kicked my computer. Sorry about that, computer. Uh, I think the storage in there is actually really all I wanted. So let's go ahead and grab the crates we have sitting around in here. Not the cardboard boxes. The crates. Where are they? Crates five. Yep, there we go. We can actually craft a bunch of these too, so. The high quality one, so it's it's nice. Alright. Let's go ahead and start dropping these. go let's have like a wall of wall of boxes here and these go here that's fine and if we don't like this we can just move them later it's okay we've needed we've needed to get a storage area going for some time now so i'm glad we finally got around to it uh That was incredibly lucky. I wasn't expecting to find a sledgehammer just, like, in a box, right? Like, I was expecting maybe, like, a magazine, something like that. But no, no, just a perfectly good sledgehammer just chilling out on the ground, waiting for little old Moy. All right, now this stuff can go on the ground. This is going to be gnarly cleanup, but you know what? It is what it is, man. Dee dee wo dee dee. I'm learning, chat. Life just dee wo dee dee, you know? Can't stress about shit. Well, you can stress about shit, but it doesn't help. Garbage bags. Lots of garbage bags. So let's go on the floor. Large metal shelves. Regular metal shelf. Well, technically, they're all large metal shelves, but, you know, half a large metal shelf. I don't even know what I'm saying by this point, chat. It's just a, it's just a large metal shelf. Go ahead and... Go on the ground there. Do something like this. And actually, yeah. Let's move these crates. See if we can, actually. Be honest. I thought we were going to break. Well, I thought we were going to break them. I know we're better at carpentry at this point, but like, I don't know, man. It's still me. It's still my luck, so. Prepare for the worst, man. Alright. Yeah, this place this is going to be gnarly to clean up, dude. Floor. Let's go ahead and just grab all of the, the tote bags. Plastic bags, trash bags. Plastic bag garbage bag yeah just to kind of make it a little easier to distinguish what's on the floor and you know what's not Yeah, this is just a it's just a gnarly ass closet, dude. Look at this shit. There's so much filth on the ground. Golly. Well, that's all right. That's all right. We should have made different fucking piles, but that's okay. We're here now, man. We're here now. Can we upgrade these actually? These crates? No, it doesn't look like it. Unfortunately, we're going to have to build them from the bottom up.
And, hmm. I think we could actually, yeah, just as items. Right, we have a crate in here. Okay. Let's do this. Place this down here. That's cool. And then we'll pro. I'm not sure we'll, where we'll put these, but, you know, we'll figure somewhere out for them. Just because we have storage over here doesn't mean we can't use this room as storage as well. So that's, um, that's what I'm thinking. We might just use this for food storage, excess storage. I'm not sure, but it's definitely going to remain storage. Let's go ahead and put these crates on the shelf. And I think, yeah, electrical parts can actually go right here. That's fine. Transfer all of those in there. got the wrench, wood axe, welder's mask, slapper knife, shovel, splitting axe, scissors, propane, torch, flashlight, metal cutters, hunting knife, hammer. Good stuff, man. Good stuff. can go on this shelf. Actually, no. We'll put tool tools on the far shelf. Components. Oh! I didn't even put all that stuff on. Gee, jeez. Like the heaviest stuff I just completely neglected to put away. We can actually, yeah, we'll put the sledgehammer on here as well because we're not going to be using it tonight, I don't think. We could, but uh, I don't want to. <laughs> it's really all there is to it. It's like 5 p.m. My boy is tired. He's peckish. That was the uh, bandage. Bitten. All right, so it's still going to take a little while. We're going to need to... Oh, shit, we just leveled up our medicine. Did not expect that. I don't remember ever leveling up medicine. I'm going to be honest with you guys, chat. Like, that's it's not something I level up very in very often. Because I, very often, when I get hurt, it's usually bitten. And there's nothing you can do about that unless you have the mods that I have installed for the game. But, uh, yeah, it's, 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 it's just, you know... <laughs> don't really remember leveling up in uh, first aid very much. Duct tape, blue chain, door hinge, door knob. Now we'll, we'll find somewhere for the door hinge and door knob. Probably keep it with the wood products. Large bolt, screws, spring. Wire. I think this is regular wire because electrical wire is specified. It's like, oh yeah, this is electrical wire. And I'm like, all right, cool, good shit. Uh, WD-40 can go in here as well. Nail gun magazine. Now nail gun magazine. That should go on here along with the mold pliers. Hello everybody. My name is Mold Plier and welcome back to the big fuzzy wuzzy. Hmm. All right. And it's not necessarily a tool, but it's a hard hat, so it feels tool adjacent almost. So we'll just put that there. Glue, WD 40, welding rods, adhesive tape, plastic bags, garbage bags. A 
aluminum amplifier. Yeah, metal and wood can go on this shelf. That's perfect, actually. Tote bag. Can I do anything with the tote bag? I don't think I can, really. So what we're going to do is just probably chuck that on this shelf and forget about it. All right, tote bag is in there. Where's my tick list? Is it main inventory? Okay. Let's go and clean this. Okay. Beer can, needle, Beretta. Might actually find a different place for all these weapons because, uh, yeah, we're running out of room, man. Running out of room. There it is. I was like, where'd you go? Beer bottle. Go ahead and just drink some beer, dude. You deserve it. After the couple of days you've had, yeah. Beer is going to be another good way to gain weight as well. A bit tipsy. You'll love to see it, man. Good stuff. We'll take these clothes out of the dryer as well. Though that'll be later, I think. Right now, right now, I came in here to throw this stuff away. Bunch of empty sewing kits. Well, we'll keep one. These bottles. Bath towel goes in here. Sewing kits. Equip secondary. Go and drink another beer, because why not? You deserve it, man. All right, we're getting there with the weight, so good stuff. Ruh row raggy. Ooh, we could put like a chair there or something. We have the, we'll put the comfortable chair upstairs right here or something. Yeah, and then we'll just, yeah, that'll be, that'll be cool. Then we'll have a little table, like a side table for all our sewing. No, nah, we'll need more than a side table for all our sewing stuff, but. Uh, do we have any more crates or I think we put them all over there. Okay. So let's grab a crate and see how it looks right there. Oh, before we do that. Go and wash. Oh, I thought thought we had more bandages to clean. Guess not. Put the crates over here. Yes. I was like, where'd they go? Is this starting to feel too crowded, do you think? If I put this here? Hey man, I mean it needs to it needs we need storage, so crowded or not. We'll figure that out later. You know? Yarn goes here, turpentine, sheets and pillows. And I kinda like the look of how three crates here. I kind of wanted to, I was going to get a fourth one going there, but I was like, eh. What we could do, though, is probably just drop this one here. And again, uh, if I don't like that, we'll just move it somewhere else or just break it and then find somewhere else to put it. But, you know, right now, just trying to find places for things, you know? Trying to find places for things. We actually don't need to have that equipped. Just need it in our inventory. And 
let's go ahead and just disassemble both of these. Because they're, they're in such... They're not as good as, you know, literally anything else we can make, so... We've, we've outgrown them, essentially. That's what I'm trying to say. And then you. Oh, wow, just random assortment of goods. Disassemble crate. All right. Electrical stuff, here we go. Painkillers. Painkillers go here. Clean kit for batteries. That can go... Do we want to have a mechanic box? We could. Honestly, that's not the worst idea we've ever had. Yeah, let's go ahead and get a mechanic box. Do we need a mechanic box? Yeah. No, I'll, I'll... Yeah, we'll get a mechanic box. Door hinge. Door knob. Planks go on this shelf. Zero, I was gonna say this. There we go, so two light switches. Got it. Planks there. Cardboard boxes. Engine parts, glass panel, tire repair glue. Wrench. Screw and nails. Oh, wrong container, wrong container. Stop. Nails, pickles, screws, not a sports book. None of that goes in there. Beer can? No. That goes in this box. Needles, pencil, thermos, prepper helmet. Is our, hmm. I'll take, yeah, I'll take the shotgun shells upstairs and the 45 shells or cases, cartridges, oh, whatever. And actually, one second, chat just needed to check something. Okay. Just need to make sure my, <laughs> my ethernet didn't drop. Sometimes if I touch the wire wrong, the ethernet just kind of shits itself, which is about as fun as you'd expect, so. If I can keep that from happening, that'd be very epic. All right. And I think we'll actually just go to sleep right now because I just need to, just need to sleep, man. Just need to sleep.
We got a lot of home projects we need to get done, man. A lot of home projects. How are we doing on weight? I'm guessing... Wow, groin bandage is still dirty, huh? Still bitten. Still bleeding. Hmm. <laughs> has items on surface. Oh. Yes, and that has items in the surface. Got it. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay, okay. All right. Mechanic stuff. Motor. Spare engine parts. Lug wrench, tire pump. Car battery charger. Mercia Lang parts. Franklin all terrain. Or all terrain? All terrain, yeah, it was auto terrain. That's not a thing. To my knowledge, chat, they're gonna drop that shit later. They'll be like, oh, we heard this wasn't a thing. So in your face, Buzz. And I'll be like, well, got proved wrong, but you know, it was also didn't really need to do it publicly. But you know, sometimes people are mean. And Buzz is just rambling because <laughs> he's so, he's just, I don't know, man. But uh, gonna go ahead and put the rice there. What was our weight? Did I check already? We're still pretty balanced. Okay. Drink some more ice cream. Another light just popped. GG's. Now we're gaining weight again. Good stuff. We can just eat a... I was going to say eat a bunch of jelly beans, but that is not possible. And we'll go ahead and just dismantle these. Excellent, man. Good stuff. Let's move that chair downstairs, and then I think we're uh, pretty good, actually. Do need to go around and just start cleaning up all this blood, because there's maybe too much of that. Maybe too much blood. Well, actually, we don't even need to move this one. There's a chair downstairs that's not getting any use at all. We could also move a couch, have like a little sitting area in the front room. That'd be nice. That'd be real nice, actually. And I know we don't necessarily need to, but I'd like to board up the outsides of the windows as well. Because right now we only have boards on the interior. I don't know. I feel like uh, oh, this would be a, this feels like it'd be a lot more comfortable too. I don't know. This chair in here feels a little bit more cozy. Let's go ahead and sit down. There you go, man. There you go. Good stuff. Good stuff. All right. Insecticide spray. Let's get some. I was going to say, let's get some breakfast. We already had our ice cream breakfast. You'll love to see it. Let's go get upstairs and drop this insecticide spray off. And then. Got some fences to destroy. Insecticide spray. Oh, we got to replant some crops as well. Let's go ahead and grab this. Equip. Dig furrow. There you go. Since we have so many carrots, actually, I'm thinking we could start using them to trap. So we got a lot of, possibly a lot of bunnies in the area, you know? We're in the woods, so it makes sense. Uh, what do we want to plant? Hmm. Bell peppers would be nice. Can we plant tomatoes? No, tomatoes require sticks and all that stuff. Wheat? Could we plant wheat? What about watermelon? Go 
grapes. Yeah, we're not even nearly close enough to farming level. Well, then I say that. Only it's only farming five, and we're at farming four, so we'll get there eventually. Lettuce, eggplants, carrots, carrot seeds, cabbage, cabbage seeds. I think we'll plant some more cabbages, because I've heard those are good for catching rabbits too. And plus they're they should be okay for like making soups and stuff, so. Eh. Plant some cabbages. Need to get some more freezers as well, because the more food we have, the uh the more uh the more storage we're gonna need to store it. Cabbage. Can I plant pumpkins? Possibly. Possibly. What can I even do with a pumpkin, do you think? Peanuts, lettuce, carrots, cabbage, broccoli, radishes, strawberry, watermelon, wheat, zucchini. Let's plant some strawberries, actually, yeah. Hmm. Strawberry seed packet. Do, 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 do. Cool. Again, sorry if I'm being a little quiet. I'm, uh, Kinda tired right now, but uh, I'm still enjoying this game. Thank you guys for uh, hanging out with me today. Good stuff, man. I appreciate it. I'd like to do some more with that hallway too, because right now that hallway is kind of just bare. And here, don't know what we're gonna do with this, but we'll find something. Maybe a weapons closet. It'd be a lot nicer than what we have here. Kind of like that idea, actually. So I'll tell you what. Let's go and just drop all this stuff. go and put it I'll put it right here which one of these is empty I'll yeah, we'll just make a quick pile here well, we can't because the cardboard books is all right, this is what we'll do. We'll just put as much as we can in here. Hmm. Pickaxe. I completely forgot we had this. Good shit. All right. Bladed weapons on the right. All the, yeah, just all the ammunition can go in a couple of cardboard boxes over here. Magazines. 
No, magazines can go up top. Insert magazine, bracket. Eject magazine. Bracket. These should go upstairs, I think. Because that's where I'm going to be doing most of my gun cleaning, right? I mean, it's my room. I'll just be, like, up there looking cool and shit. <laughs> Eject the magazine. Racket. Eject the magazine. Racket. There we go. Good stuff, good stuff. <laughs> Let's, you know what, before we start working on, or worrying about what's loaded and what's not, let's just put everything away and then work from there. Oh, pickaxe, that's why we're carrying so much stuff in here, okay. Uh, we got axes too. You go here. Beer can. Ammunition. Magazines go up top. And then we'll just load all this stuff up tomorrow. We could do it today. Boy, I thought I had a lot more 45 boxes. The box of 45 ammo. I know where to find plenty, though, so it's not like that's going to be a huge deal. But, you know, I thought we had more. Hmm. Let's, uh, let's go into town. Still want that stove, man. There we go. Actually, we don't even need to go into town. There's a stove right here, chat. There is a stove right here. Let's see if there's actually any nice carpet in here as well. Ooh, we could grab this. Good stuff. And this table, actually. Like I said, I wanted a sitting room. All right, where's the fancy table? There it is. Put it in there. Too heavy for inventory. Pish posh. <sighs> Finally, man, we're moving up in the world. We got a real stove now. Real stove. No more lighting up the propane grill. Just now we got a, like an actual honest to God stove. It's nice, man. And probably come back for that TV anyways. We can have it in like the, uh, the sitting room. Ah, 
actually, I mean, if we're, I mean, if we're already here at chat, we might as well, right? We're also looking for carpet, too. Okay, we got a couple of things we need to grab. This, this. Hmm. Yeah, like this is, this is a lot better. Is that something on the floor? It's red frilly underpants. Okay, um, no, I think I'm good. Uh, grab all this stuff up. Oh, didn't mean to grab that table. Place this down. Like right here. Resetting internet, no worries, bro. Appreciate the lurk, man. Thank you. Cool, and it's, uh, yeah. It's the same carpet everywhere. Oh, oh, wow, we're just getting real unlucky with these, aren't we? This room was just a no-go, golly. really have just gutted our house a lot or this house a lot of i would say a majority of what we have has come from this house and if not directly well eh, it'd still be directly but if it's not in the form of furniture or electric electric wear it's in the form of broken down goods and wood and stuff like that it's kind of cool it's like a. You know how when a whale dies and it sinks to the bottom of the ocean, it starts its own like little ecosystem, and things just come along and take what they need from it. It's kind of it's kind of like this. This is our uh, this is our whale. There we go. Good stuff. Time to go. I'm pretty sure this fo our forearm is good now. Yeah, look at that. Our groin should be healed up by tomorrow. At least I hope so. I really don't care if this uh, carpet breaks, man. I'm just trying to get rid of it. Do I not have any? No, I don't. Ah, I see. There we go. 
And let's actually just put the gray carpet in here. We'll put all, well, I was gonna say all the carpet. It can only hold 13, so. Let's put all this stuff in here, actually. Just to kind of lighten the load a bit. Oh, what the... Oh, the stain is going to be here regardless? That sucks. I wish I had known that. I thought the stain was on the carpet. Now I got to replace all of this. Ugh. Oh, well. You know what? Let's just... No, we don't need to replace all of it. Let's do this. Uh, pick up. We'll just... We'll have like a blue strip down the center of the room. Oh, it's not even. Shit. Well, we can make it even. Or we could just have hardwood floors. Good carpet. Orange modern chair. Uh, let's go and just, uh, put this thing in here. Ah, shit. I think we're just gonna throw all this blue carpet away because I, I really don't want to. I don't want to use it. Honestly, I have nothing else to use it for. So we'll just find a trash can somewhere. Do we have one in here? No. Really, our only trash. Well, we do have a trash can outside, so let's go and use that then. Okay. get rid of the cardboard boxes too we they're 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 not really necessary at this point now that we can craft our own boxes it's just like nah, unneeded antique tv something like this maybe and then we have the TV like hmm we'll put it against this wall for now and then we have a few more things to throw away so let's go ahead and take care of that Blue carpet, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, and then we'll, I, I said this yesterday, but we'll take care of the fences tomorrow. Golly, we got a lot of things to take care of. Where's the... I thought I picked up the... 
the orange couch, did I not? <laughs> Maybe I put him in the trunk. That's probably what happened. I put it in the trunk. Yeah, there it is. There it all is. Oh, I don't. I was like, why can't I do this? I was like, oh, I don't have my hammer or saw. That makes sense. Hammer, hammer. There it is. There you go. And yeah, we'll leave this there for now. Then have the fancy low table right in the center of it all. Actually, no, we'll move the we'll move the table a little further out. Or we could just move this chair, honestly. I think we'll put the chair here. And we'll put the we'll keep the table here. Put the chair here. That seems good. It's like a little sitting area, and then we'll put a table like right over here. What's up, Wolf? How you doing, man? Welcome back. Welcome back. Can we build a small bookshelf? Let's see. Uh, furniture, small bookcase. That's what I want to do. Okay, cool. Uh, before we do that, though, it's time to finally replace our barbecue. This is going on the roof. This is going on the roof. There you go. You know what? The green actually looks kind of nice here. It does not look bad. I was I was thinking it would look bad, but this uh, doesn't look terrible. I'm I'm kind of digging it. I'm gonna do that. Grab this propane tanks. Then we should have a propane tank chilling out in here, right? No, we had it up there. Got it. Okay. Like you got worse ever since your dad talked. Yeah, dude, that's the way it works. The internet providers... <laughs> contrary to popular belief, their job isn't to make the internet better. I don't know what what's going on, man. But they just, they do not... They do not care. It sucks, but you know. Let's actually... I was gonna, yeah, let's go to bed. Go to bed. <coughs> Oop, sorry, bumped the mic there, chat. Pat panic attack. Gee, cheese. Okay. Uh, drink some water. There we go. And then let's get something to eat. Really wish the lamps would stay on in here, though. They keep popping. That's my biggest problem. Yeah, it's just random shit in here. And then, need to eat, need to eat. How are we doing on weight? Still balanced, okay. Let's go ahead and eat just a bunch of stew. Good stuff, full of bursting. Gummy worms, jelly beans, Majeska, quagga cakes. Better? Nah. 
Do we still have that chair in our inventory? Because if we do, we could honestly just put it... Yeah, we'll put it right here. This will be like our little uh, reloading area. We could put an ammo bench right here as well. Cool. Uh, right here. And all of these are empty. Is that right? No. Go and sit down. If you can switch or something, I'll pay, bro. Like, that's the thing. It's crazy. It's crazy how bad it can get. And it's like, no matter how many times you call them, it's just like the same thing. Like, oh, we'll send someone over. And that person they send over, they mess around for a little while. And then, you know, they go back and nothing changes. Boo. There we go. Let's actually go ahead and just load all of all of our uh, cart or uh, what do you call all of our what you calls up all the clips. There you go. Open two threes, three oh eights, thirty eights. Sort 11 bullets, 15 bullets here. <clears throat> Good stuff. Desert Eagle, let's go ahead and equip a couple, or put a couple of in, put a couple in there. There you go. Reloading skill should be going up pretty soon, man. Any time now. Put three bullets there. Seven cartridges there. M14. Really? Nothing for the M14, huh? Fair enough. Three more Beretta mags. That's crazy. How close are we to uh, reloading? Now we're a little off. We're a little off. That's fine. Good stuff, man. Good stuff. Let's check our bandages. How's the how's the groin holding up? Good. We are good. We'd love to see it. Now we already ate. Let's make sure are we gaining weight again? No. Let's go ahead and fix that. <clears throat> Empty cooking pots. Fresh uncooked eggs still. Good stuff. I was going to say let's eat that chicken, but I think we can just wait, honestly. Go ahead and eat all this food. There we go. We should be... No. God, I really wish I knew how. 
I mean, I know how. It's just like a viable. Ugh. I'm not doing it right. I need to be using lentils and the like, but no, I have not been. All right. All right. We'll sort that out later then. But yeah, man. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Tools, tools, tools. Sledgehammer goes on the back. Getting an early start to the day. Let's go ahead and make some coffee. Then I think we'll uh, get ready to go. Let's actually fill up a mug. Empty mug. Fill mug. There you go. So let me actually try this. I'm going to open... Yeah, take a filter from the pack. Put that... What do I do here, man? Brew coffee. Grindy coffee. Plastic filter holder. Oh, I need a plastic filter holder? Got it. Okay. <coughs> Did not know that. Uh, can I put it back? No. <laughs> okay. All right, that's fine. Uh, let's go ahead and make a random coffee. And then let's go ahead and toss some sugar in here. Granulated sugar, sachet of sugar. There you go. Drink your coffee. Ah, and then we'll head out. 7.40. It's a great time to start our day. Great time to start our day. Start breaking all this down. Did he need to vault over the fence to do that? I guess so, man. Hey, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna impede on his process, man. That's how he does things, and more power to him, man. There we go. It's getting sweaty, but we're not. Not tired yet. Actually, no. This is what we'll do. We'll just take these three right here. On the sides like this. Just so it's, you know, even-ish. stuff cool uh what do we need to break that down we'll think about it i'll think about it okay so we're tired already drowsy already golly all right sledge goes back on the shelf and let's go ahead and get our wood chopping axe and start cutting down some trees And we should also pick up this broken glass just 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 because just in the interest of safety you know
really do need to read that carpentry book at some point. Let's go and just start sawing now. I was going to get the carpentry book and read it first, and I was like, eh. I mean, I don't know how much XP we get from sawing stuff anyway, so it's it's fine. It doesn't matter. Slithers out from the darkness. Time to hit the dusty old trail. Hey, take it easy, Echo. Thank you for stopping on by. I appreciate it. You have an excellent rest of your night, and take care. Take it sleazy. Saw logs there. Let's actually head inside for a quick little break. And get some water. Should also grab these gravel bags. Stay stay safe, player. Always, man. Always. And I'm pretty sure, yeah, it's still in here. Good stuff, good stuff. Actually, ooh, yeah, like I said, we can get a little, little, little bookshelf. I think it's, yeah, we moved our stuff over here. I keep forgetting, yeah. Uh, wood stuff, wood stuff. Wood stuff is over here. Nails are gonna be on this shelf right here. Right here. And then carpentry, wall, furniture, small bookcase. There we go. Cool. We can also put a small bookcase over here just for like, well, no, I want to keep my, I want to keep my movies and stuff upstairs with me, but ammo maker manual, sports fishing book. Go upstairs and grab carpentry real quick. Hmm. It's gonna be so nice once we finish up a series and then we can finally like pack it because I have a mod that lets you pack stuff as you've probably seen by this point. But uh, that includes books so we can just make a collection and it'll be, it'll be real satisfying. Let's go and read for maybe an hour or two. Then we'll head back out. There we go. Hey, what's up, Smitty? How you doing, man? Welcome on into stream. Good to see you. Glad to have you. Hope you're having a fantastic day. Hope you can you continue to have a fantastic day. Still playing Warhammer? How's the Ikka Claw campaign going? And tell you what, yeah, pour out gravel. Like it's gonna be. Nope, didn't pour.
all over the map now. Sent three different armies in three different directions. Fantastic, dude. That's always cool. It's just like, all right, getting enough. The For me, I'm, I always struggle to like figure out when is the best time to get new lords and stuff. Because generally speaking, I stick with one lord until like it's too late. And then it's like, oh man, I'm pulled in so many different wars in so many different directions. And it's like, oh well, guess I'll just die. <laughs> no, man, it's such a good game. Warhammer, especially especially the scathing campaign. I've said this six billion times, so forgive me if you're all tired of hearing it. But Warhammer is just a really good game. It's a very good game, chat. Let's go ahead and take some gravel. Feeling moderately exerted, chat. Feeling, uh, feeling a little bit of exertion. What's even down there, man? Just a random fence? I don't even know, man. Then I think we can remove the grass from this area. Gravel here. want to take in gravel from over there but actually chat i think i'm actually gonna call it i realize this is a bit of a shorter stream today but 
I have some uh, things I need to take care of offline for YouTube and personal stuff and work and all that good stuff. But yeah, man, thank you all so much for showing up and showing out as per usual. I truly appreciate each and every one of you. I'll see you all tomorrow, 5 p.m. Eastern Standard. We we made it on time today, so good shit. But uh, yeah, I'll uh, I'll see you all tomorrow. Take it sleazy. Adios.